Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Fina and in this video, we're starting the first hair growth challenge of 2024. A hair growth challenge is a commitment to applying a natural hair treatment to stimulate hair growth for 30 days. Thanks to these challenges, I've managed to grow my 4C hair down to my hips. If you're looking to grow your hair faster and longer, you'll love the results you can achieve with hair growth challenges. And I am so ready to start the first one of this year. Let's get started. Before starting a challenge, there are a few tasks we need to do. First, measure your hair to know exactly how many centimeters you're starting with. This way we'll have a clear before and after. So let's go ahead and measure. The first thing I do is prepare the strand we're going to measure by adding water, leave-in conditioner, and detangling it. Measuring my 4C hair is very difficult for me because of the shrinkage, so I use gel to stretch it as much as possible. Now that my hair is detangled and stretched, I'm gonna go ahead and trim the tip of my strand so that the measurement is clear and free of any split end affecting the length. I'm gonna cut just a little cause I trimmed the ends recently to start this challenge. Yeah, I know, it's still little, but what can I tell you? I'm really stingy cutting my hair. <laughs> I'll share the video of the trim next week, if God permits. Now with the tape, let's measure. And as you can see, my hair length is 44. 45, 46, and 47.5 centimeters. So yeah, we're starting this hair growth challenge with an initial hair length of 47.5. The second task we need to do is to check today's date to document the start of the challenge and ensure those 30 applications. As you can see here, today is Friday, May 24th, 2024. A quick summary, we are starting the challenge on May 24 with a length of 47.5 centimeters. Now let's go with the third task, putting my hair in a protective style. This is very important if you have 4C4B hair because we don't know if this treatment will dry out our hair or make it hard. It also reduces manipulation and makes applications easier. I never do a challenge without first putting my hair in twists. Now, let's prepare our growth tonic. We're going to infuse botanical herbs and natural ingredients that provide a variety of anti-inflammatory, anti-fungal, antibacterial, stimulating, soothing, healing, and moisturizing properties. These will help treat dandruff, hair loss, and of course, stimulate hair growth. Important note, you don't have to use all the ingredients you see here. Prepare your tonic, with the ingredients and botanical herbs you can easily find at your local supermarket. With that said, let's start the preparation. In a pot, we are going to add water and the botanical herbs and natural ingredients you can find. This is the time to go to your pantry and put everything you find into the pot. As you see here, I'm adding fresh mint, fresh rosemary, fresh thyme. Thyme is rich in vitamin C, vitamin A, iron, and magnesium, which are important for overall hair and scalp health. Horsetail, which promotes hair growth by providing silica, which strengthens hair strands and reduces breakage. Peppermint, which stimulates hair growth by improving blood circulation to the scalp. Fresh ginger roots, which stimulate hair growth by increasing blood circulation to the scalp and nourishing hair follicles. Sweet cloves, especially for preservation, for its antimicrobial properties that help maintain a healthy scalp. Bay leaves, which also have antifungal and antibacterial properties that can help combat dandruff and scalp infections. Cinnamon, stimulate hair growth and keep the scalp clean and healthy thanks to its antimicrobial properties. Moringa powder, rich in vitamins and minerals essential for hair growth and health. It also has antioxidant properties that protect the scalp and hair from damage. Neem powder, neem has strong antifungal, antibacterial, and anti-inflammatory properties 
making it effective against dandruff and scalp infections. It also promotes hair growth and reduces hair loss. Eucalyptus. Eucalyptus has antifungal and antiseptic properties, reduce dandruff and soothe scalp irritation. And nettle. Nettle is rich in vitamins A, C, and K, as well as minerals like iron and silica, which strengthen hair and promote growth. This time, I'm making a lot because I will be using it for several months. Let it boil for three minutes over medium heat. After three minutes, turn off the heat and let it sit overnight. By the next day, our herbs will have fully infused and we can move on to preservation. It keeps perfectly for months in the fridge thanks to the cloves. But I'll add 1% natural preservative, a mix of sodium benzoate and potassium sorbate. Then I'll bottle my botanical tonic, label it with the ingredients I used, and it's ready to use. Remember, don't stress about using all the ingredients. Use what you can find and leave out what you can't. Remember, even with just one ingredient, we've doubled and tripled our hair growth. More ingredients don't necessarily mean better results. Let the challenge begin. Application. We'll start this challenge with clean hair and a clear oxygenated scalp so the tonic nutrients can penetrate the hair follicles. Since it's a water-based tonic, the nutrients will reach the follicles anyway. But I feel that a clean scalp makes this process easier. We aim to provide a constant flow of nutrients to the scalp and stimulate growth so we'll apply it every day for 30 days. Apply it directly to the scalp where the magic happens to nourish and strengthen the follicles and promote hair growth. After application, massage the scalp for a minute and cover with a shower cap for about 20 minutes to open the follicles and facilitate nutrient absorption. I'm not very consistent with massages, but it's always good to do them. <laughs> we will repeat this application process every day until the challenge ends on June 24th, 2024. Then measure the hair again to see if it worked based on how many centimeters it grew. Let's do this right. If we miss five days of application, we need to make up those days and the end date moves five days later. I will try not to miss any days, but I can't promise that. It is almost impossible to do all 30 applications consecutively. There is always a day you are not up to it. The challenge started a week ago and I have only done six applications. It is completely normal to skip a day or two. <laughs> All right, beauties, we have everything ready. Now we just need to do it right. Apply the grow tonic every day for 30 days. If this botanical infusion works, we'll see our hair grow well beyond 47.5 centimeters. My hair typically grows between 0.2 to 0.8 centimeters per month. Let's see how much it grows by the end of this challenge. And well guys, this is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you would like to participate in this hair growth challenge. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss the results of this new grow challenge. Give it a like if you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!